Hey, it's Crypto Hodge. Hope you're having a great day today. And I wanted to give you a recap and update on Sashimi Swap and what's happening there at the moment. And we're all waiting for the vault to come out. And um, so that's going to be amazing when that opportunity opens up. I think it's a really, truly amazing project, the Sashimi Swap is. And the fact that they really want to go after the Uni after Uniswap, the, the market that Uniswap's taken on board. And I think they've got a great chance of doing it. I really do. I think the team behind it is phenomenal. Of course, it's the ELF team behind it, and they got some vast amount of experience. So I'm really positive about it. I really think they're going to pull something out of the bag. I really think they've got the they've got they've got everything there for them. Um, it'd be great to see some more traction um, coming on board with a sashimi swap. That would be phenomenal and i think that will happen i think it's going to take a little bit of time to be able to get that traction i also think that it might be a good idea to them to do some sort of relaunch and um, maybe do something um which they can relaunch but the trick that they've got to do and i don't think they're going to i don't think most um projects out there have actually done it the right way i think capturing the genesis block the a block when it all launches is the only best way of capturing um, people and getting people in you really want to lock those people in so the way i suggest it is of course 80 percent lock in so 80 percent of the harvested rewards get locked in they can take 20 percent and also they have to pay a fee to ex to take anything else so i think that should be about one percent i think this would really capture that um first amount of um, people that influx of people that you find coming straight away you really want to capture that because after that it really becomes difficult to get back up to where you was initially and i've seen it time and time again and it's a real shame to see that when you see something starting right up there and then it dwindles down there that's the thing that they've got to stop you got to when it starts up there you've got to keep it up there and that really means locking people in locking rewards in stop the dumping that's the key you must stop the dumping um, if you was to do a relaunch in that sense it would be the only reason to do one is to capture all that and, and the only way you do that is by stopping those who just want to harvest non-pairs and dump and just keep doing that if you can stop that from happening and really keep everyone on board then that's going to be the audience that you need when you launch other stuff and also i think more importantly besides doing all the strategic things that we're talking about you really need to be able to develop some amazing things really novel things like you know what andre cronier managed to achieve and i'm seeing every now and again a developer come on board and he's doing something really great and of course you get the benefits of that so we really need not just a dev team that can develop of what's already out there which is still an amazing feat if you can do that and that is still a strategy in itself and a successful one i believe because this is a new area and there are so much good stuff out there to emulate and to copy on board but we really you need to really master this and i think what i'm seeing is a lot of them copying and then they don't know what to do next they don't know how to go beyond that they don't they get themselves out of their depth which is natural this is a natural state because you're going into the unknown and it's only with time you de develop the skills that you need to survive and then you start to thrive if you're fortunate enough and you're on the start of something. So these are the skills and time it's going to take to develop um, Sashimi Swap. But I still think the project is honest. It is honest and it's going to hopefully achieve some phenomenal things moving forward given the few weeks ahead. And I'm really looking forward to it. So well done all the team at Sashimi Swap and I want to give Audrey... Ian, Lou, uh, Mr, all a shout out because and James, all you guys a shout out. Leave your comments below and um, please subscribe. And I want to give some of my other guys a shout out as well, like Don John, Sue, Camille, um, Stevie Boy, um, Oh My Pulse, um, Tony. Who else? Um, I, I can think of so many people I could just give a shout out to, and I want to give a shout out to them because they've supported my channel and they they watch my videos they give me so much feedback and um and some of them blame me for getting them into crypto which i apologize for but i really think that it's the future and we need to embrace it not not you know really take something from that and we're all benefiting benefiting from it so that's wonderful but um anyway leave it guys have a wonderful day and i hope you guys like and subscribe and i'll see you on the next update and have a great day all right bye for now